Hey everybody, what's up? Madman here, and welcome back to another episode of SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. And all right, this one's the next one. Let's go. All right. So so far, I've been getting a little bit more chat activity uh, or comments on the SpongeBob episode, so you might be seeing more of those. But don't get worry, guys. Destroy all humans is also going to be right around the corner as well. And also in the previous episode uh, comment board, I want to thank uh, Oleander Rainbow Glycerine. Uh, because they actually suggested, first of all, the, I don't know what the G-Love was. Oh, yeah, the robot, the G-Love. Sounds like a name of a new adult story or parody adult film of a few good men. Very good. As well as also, he, unrelated to the actual game at hand, but I think that, according to, the rain, according to uh, Rainbow Glycerin here, that there should be, and I support this 100%, a SpongeBob Bioshock mashup slash co crossover. I mean, hell, we're both under the oceans. Do we have to do the dialogue again? Please replace my antenna. Okay, we aren't. We don't have to do that. All right. But yes, so I support that idea, ladies and gentlemen. Think about it. Imagine one moment you're in bikini bottom, and next thing you know, you're in rapture. Oh no. Oh boy. Oh no. Incoming! Bullseye! Oh! Ooh. Uh, I can explain. <laughs> oh, crap. Can't even take a sip of, uh... Can't even, can't even take a sip of beer without being, you know, hit with a freaking... The giant rocket launcher. Aha! Got you! You have it. <laughs> You've been officially been disarmed. No love for you, Mr. G. Okay, let's see. What about you? Insta kill weapon! Thank you. Sandy just became the most deadliest thing in the city. Oh, oh, come on. Okay, and I just realized something, guys. In the Red Dead games, we should have gotten somebody in name of Sandy. Come on, that would have been hilarious. A nice little nod to the SpongeBob franchise. But also, just be just pure irony. Also, why is there so much toilet paper up on these roofs? Wait, what's this sign say? Coral Cola. I prefer Nuka Cola. If you don't mind. Gotcha. And there's Kelpo. Which sounds a lot like a bad disease. I don't mean kleptomania. I just mean Kleppo. Can you imagine that? Just a doctor coming up to you. I'm sorry, sir. You have Kleppo. Mm -hmm. You really got to start thinking differently about your life's choices. That's what I paid for, a button. Ah, oh, crap. I'm here in a timer. Eat at Joe's. I swear, that's like one of the oldest, I don't want to say gags, but that's definitely an old school thing. No! No! Ah, oh, bushwhacked. Uh, I think I already know the best thing to put in the description from uh, one of the meme videos I keep seeing Mar either Markiplier watching or the ones that show up in compilations. I want to be a cowboy, baby. You want to be a cowboy? I want to be a cowboy. <sighs> okay. And there's the mountain. Okay, let's give this another try. Also, by the way, guys, if you guys do enjoy these open world games, like in this style, you know, let me know, because honestly, I would like to do the uh, bunge <laughs> Bungie. No, I meant to say uh, Banjo-Kazooie games next. 
because I do have those on my uh, Xbox One. And got it. Plus, plus the Banjo Kazooie games bring back a lot of nostalgia as well. And I just realized there's tiki's up there that I should have grabbed. All that for one freaking? Are you serious? Uh, okay, I feel like at this point the game programmers. Or someone just likes trolling. I mean, look at that. Cr climbing all the way up there for one shiny. I feel like that's a flat out just a insult. <sighs> all right, let's go. No, we're not going back for the, the one shiny. Instead, we're going to that. We're going over here. Haha. Hiya, hiya. Well, most importantly, we need to get that uh, steering wheel. Boom, boom. Cross. Toasted Tiki Texas style. Toasted Tiki. I mean, if there's Thunder Tiki's, why not Toasted Tiki's? You want your Tiki's toasted? Oh, no. No, no. No, no. Please, please, hold on. Thank you. Damn it. <laughs> no discoing. There. Your punishment has been administered. Okay, let's see. Yes, go in the corner. Where's the oh there you are you flying bastard gotcha we gotta be getting closer to Larry the lobster's roof to put it on his TV antenna as well as grab this Hmm. Hmm. Nine. We have nine down and two to go. That's for messing with Texas. And more shinies. God oh, damn it! Stop chasing me! I want to lasso you! Aha! I, I have a jump attack! Sort of. Oh shit, shit, shit. Boom! Got him. You can slide down slopes like SpongeBob can. Whoa! Whoa, Pipe Club. Sp Markiplier made it look a lot easier. And I have the suck get a. No! I didn't want it. Pipe Club! Woo! Am I the newest mem. Fuck. I was about to say, am I the newest member of Pipe Club? I probably have to seek approval from the Elder Gods. But I'm pretty sure I can get in. Combo. Ah, fuck. Haha, -ha, got you, anti air. 
And we're up to 18. <sighs> really? Okay. Let me guess. Wait, how did the bus get up here? You know what? Video game logic. Doesn't have to make sense. So it'll travel to the lighthouse. Let me guess. This is going to be a boss battle. Uh, what the hell? Okay. Video game logic. Doesn't have to make sense. Okay. To the lighthouse. This has got to be a boss battle or something. It feels like a boss battle. I mean, who gives us all this shinies in? Are you ready for this, kids? Set. Go. Let me guess. It's a... Whoa! So it is a survival round. Ha! Ah! Whoa! Ah! Oh no, we got a, we got a, 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 ah, fuck it, we got a splooge bot. I know that sounds disgusting, ladies and gentlemen, but honestly, that's the only thing I can think of right now. I've just made this innocent game more disgusting, haven't I? You will fear the splooge bot. I, I'm officially making it more disgusting than it needs to be. Wait, where's there another one? Ah, of course there's another one. At least I got rid of the one that some. Haha! -ha. I win. I feel like a new sponge. So worth the injury. All right, so I can go out that way. You know what? First, let's grab this. Because I feel like uh, that button we're about to hit is going to hit the massive reset. Alright, there we go. Alright, what? Yeah, we got to go back up there. Because we still need to fix Larry the... I almost said Larry the Cable Guy. Larry the Lobster's TV reception. Which I don't know why. You shouldn't be watching TV anyway. There's nothing on. There's nothing ever on. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, my wife and I, we just stream everything. No cable. No bad ads. You know, like the ads here on YouTube about President Trump or soap or underwear. They, those exist now, ladies and gentlemen. Same advertisement style, too. Pretty much insults who you are, apparently. Seriously, rule 101 of advertisement. Don't insult your customer. All right, does that does this uh, take me like back to the beginning or something? Oh damn, all the way back. Grab all that. Take that, you damn splooge throwing robot. This splooge bot 5000. That's just. I'm not helping my case, aren't I? Yeah, I can definitely see why. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to say I'm not the most popular, but, god damn it, I will make things interesting. So we went that way, so let's go this way. Got 
those. I don't want to say nobody's messing with Texas, but uh, okay. that's right, doggos. Also, there's also one more steering wheel somewhere still in this world. I had a radar to tell me Larry the Lobster's uh, Larry the Lobster's location. Not his location, but his house's location. Ah, that's what you get for laughing at me. I destroy you! <laughs> yeah, a little harsh, I'll admit, but eh, gets the job done. Ugh. Wasn't there a fan theory out there that SpongeBob and Sandy were a thing? Or did I just hallucinate all that? Get him. Uh, Larry, where's your house? Actually, seriously, Larry, where the fuck is your house, bro? Damn it. Feeling refreshed. Feeling refreshed while we're in SpongeBob's SquarePants' underwear. I gotta use that, uh... There we go. Yeah, I don't... Ow. Oh, come on. I wasn't anywhere close. Seriously, where the hell's Larry's, uh... Did we actually do it yet or no? Okay, that's better. All right, uh, let's go back there and we'll see where his house is. Larry, you fixed your TV antenna, I think. Oh, thank you. I can finally watch those reruns of the Rockfish Files. Oh, I did. All right, well, where's the... Uh... I don't know how I've lived... All right, let's see here. End of the road. Come back with the cruise bubble, end of the road. All right. Okay, so we just gotta find the next steering wheel, which I don't think it's up here, or maybe it is. But first let's get SpongeBob involved, as we need his feet. Pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Ow! It shines. Oh, wait, wait, what's that? What's that? Oh. oh. Patrick will be glad to have this back. Okay, so that's an interesting ability. All right, let's swap back to Sandy. We'll go back to, um, I think we got all the, uh, steering wheels, uh, 
Yeah, I think we got all of them on the rooftops. Time to go back down to street level. So we just need one more steering wheel, and then we'll hand that one in, and then we gotta come back when we get the cruise bubble. Yeah. If I were a steering wheel, where the holy hell would I hide? Oh, right over there. Well, that was easy, conveniently placed location. But first, total disarmament. There's another one. Yep, we got them all. Well, I don't want to say, well, that was rather easy, but that was rather easy. But now, destroy all the tiki's. But I want to get that sock that's up there. The question is, how the holy hell are we supposed to get up there? Ask and you shall receive, I guess. Cowabunga! Come on, yeah! Ooh. Do I really have to carry Patrick's sock? Short answer, yes. Yes, you must. Fort is written in the lore? Of course you do. Pretty. Chop. Not to sound like this person, but can anybody see any other socks? Nope. Actually, you know what? Incoming! Ha! Ha! I karate chopped. Alright, let's talk to Mrs. Puff. But first, we must save this citizen from being attacked by the Robo Dogs. Yes, citizen, you have been saved once again. Wait, there's a jellyfish coming at you. Got him. Yes, going on. Go along your day, citizen. Just remember the Hall Monitor was here. We got over 9,000. Hey, we got over, hey, we got over 9,000 shinies. All right, Mrs. Puff. Well, if it isn't Sandy Cheeks. Howdy, Mrs. Puff. Are you seriously telling me I got to be SpongeBob character in order to get the? <sighs> All right, where's the nearest bus stop? <sighs> I got. I can't believe I got to be SpongeBob to get to. Uh get the uh, goddamn you think it would be like they're all the same heroes and stuff you think that would be enough but no I gotta be a specific character oh well at least we're getting more shinies along the way alright there's the checkpoint alright why was we talk to bubble buddy Sandy? Howdy, Bubble Buddy. That's it? That's all the dialogue we get? Alright, there's gotta be... Shit. I think there's only one location I know where... I think I found the only location up there. All right, swap out for SpongeBob. Okay, I can't believe I gotta be SpongeBob for this. Yeah. All right, you know what? We're gonna speed there quickly. SpongeBob, <laughs> I'm impressed. How did you fight? How did I find him? Well, there were these robots. I met Sandy, and the lighthouse was. Okay, okay. Sorry I asked. Here's the golden spatula that I promised you. Perfect. Thanks, Mrs. Puff. Now I'll help you guys evacuate. But SpongeBob, you don't have a driver's license. Oh, don't I? No, no you don't. 
Well, if I don't, then what's this? That's a library card where your smile is even more ridiculous. A library card. Oh. Nice try, SpongeBob. Uptown and downtown. Okay. Well, let's head back to, uh, because as you can see here, we got all of them except for one sock, and also we need to come back here with the cruise bubble. Well, so oh wait no we ha we still have Goo Lagoon. It's time to spend more time with the Goo. Better than Goop, I guess. Hey, uh, don't even ask, ladies and gentlemen. No, don't seriously. Don't ask about that stuff. If you have to, talk to John Tron. All right, so we we've been doing this for about maybe uh, 20, 26. Hmm. First of all, let's talk to mix, uh, Mr. Krabs. I almost call him Mixer Krabs. Yes, arg. His next album coming out soon. I love opening presents. Actually, that's a good question. Jellyfish shields. Uh, except for all the socks we miss, but oh well. All right, but first let's talk to talk to Mr. Krabs. So, do you want to trade shiny? That's quality craftsmanship. That is. Come again. And now we have 21. All right, let's see here. Your treasure chests looking a bit light, boy. 9,000? Man, I've heard of the meme it's over 9,000, but not over 9,000 like that. That's just insane. At least we paid that off. But who wants to see here another applause? Another applause. All right, let's travel to Goo Lagoon. After we have a mysterious hand just come out of nowhere and place me two feet in front. Darcy, to Goo Lagoon. We might as well take a look around before we call it an end in an episode, right? Let's see what this Goo Lagoon looks like. I'm assuming there's goo. I hope there's no goo. Goo, you think you're getting sand in your pants and your shirt and your socks is annoying. Can you imagine what goo would feel like? Uh, goo Lagoon, a sun-drenched beach of sludge at the bottom of the sea. But all is not well here on Paradise. Uh, welcome to Goo Lagoon. It shines! Oh, he hit himself in the head. Let me hit you in the head. Uh, I know about this one. Flip it over. Destroy all tiki's. Forget to destroy all humans. Just destroy all tiki's. That's where your money's is. Can't tell if that sound coming from the fish or the robot. Nah, it's the fish. Ooh, flash fried fish. Here's the egg. This is this robot is called Monsoon. Watch out for his lightning attack. I don't see. Oh, I see. I already know that. How do you like that? Up. Uh, okay. Let's destroy all that. But first. Do we need more undies? Fresh, like a spring breeze. So apparently if we touch the goo, it just flings us back. SpongeBob, do I look burned? No, you look cooked. Well, you do look a little red. Barnacles! That darn robot. Robot? Yeah, a big robot stole everybody's sunscreen. Dicks! Oh no! Everyone will burn, and then they'll get all itchy and peel. But, but, well, you're a sponge. Why do you need suntan lotion if you're a sponge? Exactly. You can't spend a day at the beach without sunscreen. That sun is way too hot. Or spending any time at Disney World or Universal Studios. Sunscreen, everybody. That robot is out on the island. Nobody can get to him. That robot stole everybody's suntan lotion. It looked like you couldn't even steal a cold. 
SpongeBob, maybe you can use those sun reflectors to point the sun's rays on that robot. If you hit one of the buttons on the side of a lifeguard tower, the reflector will turn. Connect all the towers and the light will shoot right out of the big reflector on the island. Why do you have this again? Then all you have to do is swim out to the island and turn the big reflector onto the robot. I'll stay here <laughs> and protect the babes. Yes, you do that. But I uh, can't swim. Hmm. Aw, seagulls. And we hit a checkpoint. Alright, this seems like a good point to take a break. So let's see. Industrial park. Oh boy. You know what? Let's see what areas we got. We got the Goo Lagoon, Sand Mountain, Poseidon, Flying Dutchman's Graveyard, the Chum Bucket, Chum Bucket Lab, Kelp Forest, Mr. Krabs. Let's see. If this is intricate. Intri intricals. Just variations of three, so 9,000, so 12,000. Wait a second. Four, 12,000, 15,000, 18,000. Oh, man. Eventually, I'm going to have to get up to 30,000. God damn. SpongeBob's Dream, Patrick. How many socks? Does and then Industrial Park, Rock, Rock Bottom, Mermelair. Uh, we got a long way to go. There we go. Alright guys, time to call it here. Plus also, it's still pretty damn early. I might... Can I get a live stream in? Hmm. I... <laughs> Maybe not. Alright everybody, well thank you very much for watching, greatly appreciate it, uh, be sure to give this video a like, be sure to, well, give it a, write down a comment, because honestly I do enjoy answering them as well as reading them, and also be sure to follow as well, I greatly appreciate it. Also be sure to follow me on Twitter for when new episodes go live, as well as other cool stuff. I'm the Madman, I'll see you guys next time for more. Later!